so we've just received the delivery of this beast and this is a Whistler Siren Sister 6 burner as big as you can get from the Whistler portfolio and this little thing weighs in at 138.5 kilos so the point of this video is to say that you can't unload it yourself and get it out of this robust pallet that's been built to protect the base because it's just too heavy to manhandle on your own so you need a minimum of two people to be able to lift the actual grill out of the crate so we've we've got quite a sturdy crate for transportation and then you'll see on the diagram that we've got a curtain of stainless steel that runs around the bottom of the grill and if you're not careful and you don't lift it clear of the actual wooden crate it will actually bend on there so it's really really important that you lift and move it out of the crate so we'll show you how it's done so Chris and I will now show you how best to take this off the crate we hope so first thing is just get rid of the plastic straps use a decent pair of scissors if you've got them then the lid comes off very straightforward the corners supporting corner units very important on this packaging four of those away then we've got two main cardboard sections and then we reveal the beast that's the siren sester six on the side of each grill you've got a hand a hand cut out so you can put your hand in there so that's important for your grip so the best thing to do is take some of the accessories out just get rid of as much weight as you can if you lift the lid start with have a look in the lid and you've got grates which is worth taking out as well because they're flipping heavy you'll find all the grills are strapped in and they've got little tie wraps for transportation purposes so if you snip through those and get those out of the way so now we've taken all the grates, all the heavy stuff out, and it's just a shell of a barbecue, which is far easier now to lift. Ready? So now we're in a situation where two people can now lift this barbecue, but you've got to lift it up and across and out. Ready, Chris? Up, across, walk it clear, mind your toes, and down. And that now is a perfect barbecue and no damage to the bottom. You can see the structure of this pallet. It's really well built to ensure that this barbecue arrives in good shape. But more importantly, you have to take it out with two people, lift and move.